I first got involved with Canada in a Day when Trish Dolman, the director, uh, approached me. She and I had worked on Eco Pirate a few years before. I was flattered that I was asked to participate. <laughs> um, and, uh, and, I, and I thought it would be a creative challenge and an enjoyable one. Well, I think Canada in a Day, that whole concept in a day, is just inherently a radically different concept of how a film should be made, where it's kind of crowdsourced and everybody shoots their own little story. But I think at the end of the day, you get something that's pretty special, personal, and natural, and you just wouldn't get any other way. My process is the same for every project, where I experiment in a kind of non-goal-oriented way, with sort of the thought of the film in the back of my mind, but not necessarily thinking of a particular scene or a character or anything like that. And then I come up with a group of sketches and then try them against the film. And, and it's sort of the, the happy accident school of composing. And because what it seems is, and I know other people work in different ways, but, but for me, what I will come up with by accident is always better than if I sat down and said, what music am I gonna put in this scene? Coming up with music that brings something out in a scene that maybe you hadn't even thought of uh, is a big part of my process. Thank you.